Fantastic Four trailer. What are my thoughts? Honestly, I'm not looking really forward to this movie. I heard a lot. So much bad things from this film. Does that mean it's going to be a bad film? It doesn't. I mean, you got to get there. You got to watch it for yourself. You got to see, judge it for yourself. Hey, if you want to watch it at all, if it's going to be a good movie or not. Um, but the expectations, that is a, that's just another story. You can have expectations going into a film. That's only natural. Watching this trailer, my expectations are not super low and not super high. It's like neutral, honestly. It's like right in the middle. Um, the trailer looked, it definitely reminded me of Chronicle a little bit. It, um, uh, I could see, you know what, um, what's his name? Teller. Teller, like, he looks a little different. I mean, I think he was the nerdy guy. He looks a lot different. So did Michael B. Jordan. It must be because they, they, I don't know, they, Michael B. Jordan because he shaved his facial hair. Or, uh, they looked a little bit different. A little bit, a little, a little younger. A little, just, just a little different. Um... I mean, we all know that, I guess there's a controversy. It's not that too much of a controversy. I don't know what's the big deal. Well, Michael B. Jordan's going to be Johnny Storm and, you know, Sue Storm's uh, white and, you know, Johnny Storm's black. So, I mean, but they could, I mean, adopted siblings. It, it doesn't matter. I mean, it, I don't see what's the big deal about that. It's fine. It's, it doesn't take away from the character Johnny Storm. It only makes him more, honestly... It, it probably makes it more interesting, you know, just to, uh, pretty much putting the background, uh, family background in in uh, full center. But overall, they don't even need that. I mean, I, I think it just does not take away from the character at all. Pretty much, uh, Johnny Storm. It doesn't. Johnny Storm is a kind of character that doesn't matter what race he is. He's as long as you keep the pretty much his powers, uh, maybe a smart-ass attitude, just his overall. I think Michael B. Jordan, I really like this guy. I think he's a great actor. I think he's going to do a great job with Johnny Storm. Now, with Sue Storm, I don't know too much of this chick. Um, she Does she look like a Sue Storm? I'm not a big fan of Fantastic Four in general. I mean, I hated the last two movies. Um, but the Sue Storm I saw in this trailer... She, uh, we'll see what she got. I mean, it's really going to come down to her acting ability. I think it really did come down to Jessica Alba's acting, and it was terrible. Uh, I mean, Jessica Alba kind of looked the part. She definitely had, well, she was pretty hot. You know, she's hot, and Sue Storm's supposed to be hot. But her acting was terrible. Now, tell her, uh, he's a great actor. Uh, him as uh, Reed Richards. Looking, seeing him in this film, I could see it. I could see it in when watching um, the trailer. I mean, I could see him as Reed Richards. And then you have, uh, I forgot what this other guy's name is. I think he's, uh, some, it's not Hoodlum. He looks like Hoodlum. Uh, but the guy who's going to be playing the thing, you know what? I kind of dig. I kind at the end of the shot of this trailer when we have all four of them, you know, standing together. I kind of dig in the like the look of the thing. I mean, he look he looks like the thing. I mean, some of the effects on this trailer though, like the fire scenes. Uh, there's Sue Storms holding somebody in the background. Looks totally like they need to finish that up because it does not look good. It looks still looks like you know a background of um, green screen. So, uh, they need to finish that thing up. The special effects definitely need to be finished up, hopefully, when the time it's released. Hopefully, that's not the final product, because this movie's on its way. It's almost here. It's just right around the corner. Uh, well, we have seven months until this movie is released. Uh, overall, though, it, the trailer was just eh. I mean, you had a lot of people, you had a lot of, basically, of course, scientific stuff going on The the uh, tone of it felt definitely independent or a little bit definitely had that cool, cool like tone, uh, tone to it. I mean, like cool colors, like watercolors to it, like Chronicle. It, it reminded me of Chronicle a lot. And, you know, this is the director of Chronicle. Um, hence, but no, you know, <laughs> shaky cam or no, um, you know, handy cam with them. Uh just this trailer didn't really do too much for me. I think that was um, what's his name, Doctor Doom. Um, I'm forgetting everybody's name. I think that was a uh, uh, oh Kebble. I think that was Kebble doing the voiceover, and I can't wait for Kebble. Kebble is definitely 
he's always been one of my favorite actors who doesn't get a lot of appreciation. And he really shined as Koba in uh, Planet of the Apes, the Dawn of Planet of the Apes. I think he's going to nail Doctor Doom. I think he's a great. He's going to be a great Doctor Doom. Uh, now the take on him as Doctor Doom, where he's like this hacker or whatever. That's I think that's interesting. I mean, I'm not. Fantastic Four is just kind of. There's a reason why that comic went out. Because nobody wa wants to read Fantastic Four because guess what? It's not, they're not too excited. They're actually, they're kind of just mutants. Even though they were transferred, you know, they got in an accident like Spider Man stuff. Uh, but wasn't Spider Man considered as a mutant in the animated TV show? They're kind of like mutants, but, you know, they are beloved. But overall, like, Fantastic Four is kind of boring. They're not really in that too interesting. I'm not a fan of them. If you guys are a fan of Fantastic Four, that's fine. Everybody had to each their own. But I just do not really care for the Fantastic Four. And the newer, the better to me. So uh, having Doctor Doom as, you know, this hacker or having uh, Johnny B. Jordan, you know, be different, you know, different race, whatever. They're changed. It is what it is. I just want to see something new. I want to see this. Hopefully, it's not a disaster like they say it is. Hopefully, like, um, you know, this. I've been here. You heard that the director, like, pretty much was a total dick in the, the whole process of this. He wouldn't even show up. Uh, I believe, uh, I believe people are over there at the studio are just like, freaking panicking because this movie is just terrible and they don't know what to do with it they were even thinking about scratching it there's a lot of rumors and a lot of things going on around this film there's, i mean nothing's bad press hopefully it does turn out great hopefully it, it turns out like to me uh definitely blow my expectations but honestly when i saw this trailer this trailer is nothing too too much to get at i mean just a lot of scientific stuff a lot a lot I'm pretty sure this movie's going to really deal with basically. It's just definitely an origin story. Just going to deal with that origins and how they use their powers, and we won't get you know we'll get that Doctor Doom fight at the very end. It's going to be kind of like Fantastic Four, the first film that came out. Uh, not not the freaking one they just made so they could keep the rights. The the first one with um, Jessica Alba. It's going to be like that, but it's definitely not going to be more. It's definitely not going to be kid friendly. This is more realistic down. Um, not realistic, but more of uh, uh, definitely a serious tone to it. So my thoughts on the trailer? Eh, it was alright. Whatever. I mean, we can pass. It. Pass. That's it. That, that's it, guys. I mean, do you get, did you guys really like that trailer? Because the trailer was okay. I mean, it wasn't too much. I mean, we got a few shots of them using their powers. We got Johnny Storm blazing up. Ooh. We got a. Uh, you know, Sue Storm, I think, does a little, you know, force shield or whatever. We saw the thing twice. We saw him, like, when this... I, I really did like that shot when you see just, like, these rocks and he's, like, crumbling. I like that. For some reason, I thought, I thought that was really cool. Uh, Teller, I think we saw his arm really stretch. I couldn't really tell. But um, overall, I mean, come on. It's whatever. I mean, we're all just looking for the Avengers. <laughs> so thank you guys for listening. If you like this video, please push the like button. And please subscribe for more. And... Let me know. Let me know what you thought of this trail. I, I, it's, it's, yeah, it's whatever, man. It's, it's, it's all right. Thanks.